Get in there, Jack. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's not ideal. We can worry about leaving after we get the data we need. Just gotta find a transmission that matches the other signals we found. Another signal match. That's got to be the lab. So we've got enough to find it. Got to run a formal trace, but yeah. You want to tell Marcus or should I? Let's just get back to the skiff. We can tell him on the move. Jack, pop this lock. <laughs> Check it. Jack's cloak can now make us invisible, too. Invisible, huh? We might want to try it. Jack, cloak. Go, let's go. And we gotta do something. Come on then. Back to the skiff. <laughs> Not so fast! Snipers ahead! If only we could turn ourselves invisible somehow! Way ahead of you! Let's take them down! <laughs> Got them all. Let's get down the hill and back to the skiff. All right, you ready to go find that lab? Yep, ready as I'll ever be. I gotta ask you something. Once you get yourself answers. Yeah. What then? I mean, what happens next? What are you actually asking? Look, I know you're not exactly thrilled to be in the cog. Hey, if you're worried I'm gonna run off or something. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not worried you're gonna run off. Oh, no? Well, maybe you should worry. At least a little bit. Oh. Great. When we get to the skiff, let's tell Marcus what we're doing. Okay, but I got another question. If you did leave, where would you go? Mm, pre or post swarm outbreak? Hmm. Pre. Some place with a beach. And post? A bunker, five miles underground. Okay. You got room for two? Aren't you forgetting Jack? Yeah, but he doesn't take up much space. What about you? Where would you go? You know what? I have no idea. 
But I tell you, it'd be no snow. I'll take navigation. Black. Nothing here. Yeah, I don't get it. Look, the data checks out. We're in the right place. Maybe Jack can, I don't know, use Pulse to ping the signal. Worth a try. Jack, Pulse! <laughs> what we're looking for. How do we get down there? Not easily. Ice this thing, it's like concrete. Hang on. The phosphorus. We could use it. Wait, seriously? Trust me on this. All right, let's get this phosphorus cooking. small detail. Once we get through that ice, getting back up might be tricky. Then I guess we'll have to deal with that. Solid observation. Called phosphorus. Fine, whatever. You said it feeds off oxygen and water. Yeah. Yeah, we're about to expose it to a ton of ice, which is oxygen and water. Yeah. Huh. It'll be fine. What are you basing that on? Thermodynamics. Reaction kinetics. Somebody want to let me know when this chemistry class is over? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Safety first.
fine. Uh, see? Fine. Look, that must be the Kadar radio tower. Means the lab's not far. Come on. Jack, you good? Oh. You, you know you don't have to. Sooner or later, they'll know who you really are. Don't belong with us. You withhold. You withhold the truth. Why do you think that is? Sooner or later. What are you resisting? What are you resisting? Is it a guy that's not on you? They brought me to swarm you. What are you resisting? Don't. Is it a guy that's not on you? Help me. You're nearly there. You're a child. Stop, stop fighting. It's him. Something will cease. You don't belong to them. You're one of us. Nothing. Well, we're good because we found it. Come on, we just need to figure out how to get inside. Do you need a minute? No. No, I'm good. Let's do this. I'll tell you one thing a bunch of renegade scientists didn't build this alone. We're not getting in there. Not with those turrets in place. Generator here. like that did the trick. Shit. We didn't get all of them. Gotta be another generator somewhere. Found the other one. Now are you ready to get some answers? More than ready.
Hey, stuck me. You're this upset about a pinprick? I have sensitive hands. Proper identification is required for entry. Your entry has been denied. Good day. A uh, what? Niles? Is that you? Proper identification is required for entry. Proper identification. Hey, you can give it a shot. But it's gonna hurt more than you think. that welcome home? Do you really require an explanation? I think I like the gibberish spouting novels more than this cryptic garbage can. Ah, I see you've met my vastly inferior construct at New Hope. This way, please. What the hell? It's freezing in here. Goodness. Apparently, some of our cryojets are malfunctioning. There must be a fault in our system. You don't say. Of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. Would you mind terribly? Miserable little garbage can, mother... Cryojets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Let's get back to that garbage can. Well done. Yeah, Jack's good. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. of an old industrial accident. Tell these tanks. Same as the ones at New Hope. Yeah, I noticed. Ah, yes. My work there began as an effort to cure children ill with rust lung, but it grew into something far more significant. The cog wanted medicine. I gave them gods. Oh, well. Water under the bridge. This way, please. shut you down why come all the way out here our family needed a place to continue our work in solitude <laughs> no way your family built this alone i am quite certain you lack the necessary clearances for that information please if you will come this way
This next area is quite fascinating. What the hell? The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own. Especially interesting. What is it? That is one of our first successful hybrids. Hybrid? You mean a locust? One and the same. In our previous facility, we had problems with genetic stability. The sires were distempered and sterile, a problem for obvious reasons. But the locusts were different, highly controllable, the perfect soldiers, and blessedly able to reproduce. What made them different? Their cells. You see, the emulsion miners' children provided a marvelous genetic repository, as did the indigenous creatures of the Hollow. In all of your genetic research, it's in here? Of course. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Jack, Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira, or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mira's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Raina. Your mother. What? You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey, what are you... Why did you come here with me? What did J.D. tell you? Hey, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Or maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the Locust. Now, shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. It killed her. I killed her. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. What? 
I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. You think or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just, I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. Okay. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me something. My grandfather, who was he? One of my best geneticists. He pled with little Raina because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Raina had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. work turn on you. I choose to view it differently. The Locust longed for independence. Mira showed them the way. I have always been proud of your grandmother. I still am. This way, please. What the hell is that thing? The Matriarch was generated from your grandmother's stem cells and sire DNA. She amplified Mira's ability to communicate with the Locust. This device is where Mira first learned to control her power, but we can also use it to sever your link, if you choose. So how does it work? By mildly damaging your brain. What? by mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the Locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. Sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind, undetected, to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood. painless 
as possible. Yeah, you better. She's alive. What? It, it wasn't really her, except, except it was. Where is he? Emergency shutdown in effect. Come on. He went this way. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Hey, 
okay? It's getting colder. We gotta do something. Shit! I think this was Niles. Just slap his hand on that scanner. Identification. Director Niles. Industrial accident in my ass. He put this whole place in a deep freeze right before he bled to death. Good fucking riddance. Uh, Del? The matriarch is... gone. Oh, I'm sure that's not... Let's just find Niles, come on.